Oh no, food labels aren't written for you. They're written to get past you. DE is one of those hidden little abbreviations or numbers that explains a lot. Think of starch as a long chain of glucose units. When you break that chain into shorter pieces, it behaves less like starch and more like a sugar. An apple doesn't require scientific literacy. You fancy an apple, you buy an apple, you eat an apple. But with processed foods, you're basically reading Tolstoy just to figure out what you're looking at and maybe a tech geek is needed to work out code, followed by a lie down in aisle 3. That how broken down is my starch molecule level is DE, dextrose equivalent. And remember, dextrose is basically glucose. So starch sits near zero. Maltodextrin is usually in the DE 3 to 20 range and pure dextrose or glucose is DE 100 because dextrose is just glucose. Higher DE means shorter chains, usually more soluble, often a quicker hit in the body and very useful for texture and shelf life as I've explained before. And that's why you rarely see DE on the label. It's a technical spec on ingredient data sheets, not something they want front and centre for you to question. I sound like a conspiracy theorist. Who cares?